Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the Forex Pisami.com forum weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation of the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit ForexPisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Welcome back everybody, let's take a look again on the euro currency. Let's go back to our analysis that we have. So you can see indeed it's our production has continued uh, yesterday and as we said don't worry about too slow up production on Monday because the United States is just waking up from the three days holidays and as soon as they turn back to the activity it should be more volatility on the market besides uh, today's inauguration and tomorrow is for European Central Bank meeting that is actually should bring even more volatility on the market. Our major concern here is whether we should take the short position or not because actually uh, the predefined conditions that we said in weekly report since all trend has turned bearish except monthly so we have the bearish trend on the weekly we have the bearish trend on the daily chart we said we need to consider possible taking of short positions and preliminary statement was to consider it around 2150 because this is confidence resistance on the fall time frame chart on the hourly chart and that is first more or less suitable area to consider possibility for taking the short position and that's what we intend to do today so on the daily chart in general uh, overall price action looks actually not bad and theoretically it could happen that's really could just continue our production because here we see hint of possible morning star pattern of the three candles not actually perfect but some hint on the bullish activity that we still have and for us it is crucial critical to not uh, make a mistake with taking the short position to uh, carefully assess how comfortable to us the taking the position right right at this moment so on the daily chart actually as you can see nothing has changed significantly market stands in upper bounds from the support it's 263 is major support also we have estimated that this is agreement support because on the intraday chart we have the XOP target that may, uh, that stands precisely at this level and you can see the healthy bounce so uh, that's actually was the reason why we also discussed the possibility of the taking long position for those who trade on intraday charts around this level so anyway on the follow down from chart what we have uh, here we have the positive divergence, the XOP. It's not shown here. It stands on the hourly chart, but we have a divergence with this type of action. And take a look, market has completed the kind of the harmonic swing. So on the downside action, it, it happens just two times. But if you uh, try to find it on other by type of action, you can see that the swing repeats relatively often here on the market. So you can see it well very often happens on the intraday charts so and uh, as market stands it resists it completes the harmonic swing this is important moment where potentially market could turn down because here's our major ABCD pattern and its OP has not been reached yet so theoretically through testing at 120 are in completion the OP as we said previously it could be good uh, final point if market stands with a retracement uh, it's bright finish of the retracement in, in our case um, so that's uh, what we keep an eye on on the fall down from chart and for, for us currently is major question is whether we should consider taking short position right here with a down uh, action to the OP or something looks not good and we should wait a bit more so on the on the hourly chart uh, I also show you the alternative scenario that is actually very similar to the gold market as we discussed recently as well so what we could get uh, actually on the hourly chart as we said this is confidence resistance and natural support resistance is very important for euro currency as you consider previously this also was the important level so resistance 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 bro broken support 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 again now it will be again resistance so that's important area for the euro and what does it mean it means that if market will break it up it gets relatively free space of action higher at least for 100 200 pips to the upside 
And that also could mean that we actually stand already in the continuation of the major trend. So this market doesn't want to show deeper retracement and turning up, forming, for example, even some reversal swing to the upside if it breaks 2236. That will be the hint. That's probably where we're going higher. Uh, and that's for its critical moment to us. We should not miss this. So, uh, and that's alternative scenario. For example, since this is strong resistance, you no, know, the confluence, also the synchro, the ABCD param XOP agreement, that's important, that we'll show you a bit later. Uh, the first reaction on this level could be the bounce. But bounce could be of the different scale. So we intend, we, we uh, would like to see the drop to the 120 area. It's completely OP. So we do not want to get the hand shorters, at least from the position of the uh, bearish trading, right? But if we are wrong, the so market could form just minor pullback here, 21 area, where it stands the previous lows, forming the hand and shoulders pattern, and to form the uh, clear bullish reversal pattern with the possible upper continuation. Just the minimum target will be around 22.36, but potentially this pattern could become the starting point of the upper continuation of the major trend. So, and that makes it a bit tricky. Um, idea of the taking the short position right at this moment. It's first moment. Second, uh, the, the overall situation could be tricky as well if market will just break through the confluence and will continue our protection. So what we could do in the current circumstances, the problem is, is that with this up we do not clear, we don't have clear ABCD patterns, we don't some, something like here, right? So it's a bit where you could say that it's OP and some reaction should happen. So it's not. Here's where we mostly have gradual, straightforward upper action. So uh, if you will drop the time frame to the 15 minute chart, you clearly could see this ABCD pattern. Why I'm choosing this ABCD points? Because take a look, till this moment, this was relatively gradual action. Once this retracement has happened, the shape of the price action has changed. It shows the acceleration. It means that this ABCD is a major one. So OP stands right here. Now you can see market hits the XOP as well. But the problem here is that we do not have clear bearish reversal patterns on the 15-minute chart. Nothing. It's not the butterfly. It's not the three drive. And from that standpoint, it looks a bit not quite comfortable to take position blindly just because market is confidence. Well, theoretically, it is possible because general confidence tends on our chart. But I would like to get more some reversal pattern here, something at least that could point that market indeed showing the reaction this level before taking any position. So that's why I'm more gravitating to idea that's <clears throat> especially taken in the consideration of recent action. So to add a bit more to the context, the bearish context. So we have the part of the context in place that we have the confidence. We have the XOP, it's in general it's agreement, but I would add the passion. On, on, on the lower time frames, on the 15 minute chart, maybe on hourly chart, some head and shoulders, some, something on the butterfly, maybe double top or something of that sort, before taking the position. Or at least if you are not sure that you will get it or you probably, you probably could interpret this and you are already taking the position, at least take the half of your trading volume. If this will be no, uh, patch in the market just will break this level up. You at least will get the stop loss on just in the half the position that could become just very small amount of money. Uh, and if the position will be formed, uh, sorry, if the patch will be formed later, you could add more based on the patch to your trading volume and then you will be possessed for this possible downward action. So that's what we have currently. Oral situation stands. 70% <clears throat> ready for taking the position, but we need a bit more confirmation. And let's keep watching once reaction will start, if it will start, of course, uh, what will happen around 21 area. So what the reaction will be. So the signs that market will reverse up here and start forming controllers tell us that uh, it could not go to the OP. So if market will start to form larger standing, larger scale of the bullish pattern. If will be our continuation without any stop around 121 and so will be uh, normal price action that, we, that stands in a row with this ABC patient. So that's another subject to keep an eye on today on Eurocurrency.